They open up in three wide receivers. Barry. Yeah. Underneath. Run to the football on defense. Bronco Mendenhall wants them to be aggressive and go to the ball, and they did just that on the quick out pass. Slip screen knocked down by John Denny, six foot six. Well, with Ronaldo Brathwaite. Brathwaite gets the carry. He is a slashing back down the left sideline out to the 40 yard line. It's Georgia Tech. First and 10, throws the ball outside to Tahi, picks four wide receivers. Inside to Christensen, who catches it, gets out to the 45 yard line. Barry, inside to Hale, who fights out close to the 40. Fourth and three. Down the seam to the tight end. Daniel Coates, touchdown Cougars. Right in, safety's got him, but he just runs by. And here's the thing, Daniel Coates is a former wide receiver. He was 200 pounds last year, put on 40 pounds. Plenty of time, the screen. Inside to Tahi. 15 for the Cougars. Throws it to Coates. Backfield. Under pressure, Barry throws and hits Coates, who gets a block. Here's in their passing game. Not so. Barry steps up inside and goes to Coates on the crossing route again. This time he's hammered outside the 25. Barry inside to the fullback, Justin. Or she fence. Matt Berry goes to work, hands the ball off inside right now to Brathwaite. Third and five. An area the Cougars have struggled in tonight. Berry under pressure. Pumps and finally finds Kokahiku. Shotgun pressure again. Man free. Dumps it inside to Justin Jory. From under the center, Berry straight drop. Doesn't like what he sees. Breaks out to the right. Then it's Vakapuna. The fullback of that defense. Third down. Barry out in the flat. Trouble on third down. Matt Barry standing in the pocket, getting a pretty good blocking from his offensive line. Justin Jory running the option route. Barry flushes right. Finds Christensen down to the 30-yard line, but we've got a flag on the play. Three receivers bunched right. Pitch to Brathwaite. Gets outside. He's got the corner. Finally stood up at about the 30-yard line. Barry inside to Justin Jory. Barry out quickly to the swing on the left-hand side. Jailbreak, Henderson with the pressure. The throw to Tahi. <laughs> Barry, under center, pitches it to Tahi. Here comes the reverse. Rod Wilkerson with great speed, down close to the 10-yard line. With a pro set, two backs. Hands the ball inside to Brathwaite. He makes a couple people miss. Gets out near the 30-yard line. Six yards to carry. You can live with that. BYU goes to three wides. The toss to Brathwaite. Again, showing great speed. Second and four. Barry out of the shotgun. Underneath. Wilkerson's got the ball. Splits two defenders and is dragged down inside the 30-yard line. She mentioned about Matt Barry having uh, maybe not getting in the game in the first half. Gary Croton sitting with him along with Robbie Bosco because you can settle. A lot of games a year ago when Ingman struggled. Play action pass. The little dump outside. To Chris Hale, who's got some wheel and flat, light it up. Barry hands to Brathwaite to the left side, breaks a couple of tackles down to about the. Jory in motion on first and ten, the bootleg. The deep crossing route to the tight end, Daniel Coates. And you see the linebackers lose Daniel Coates. Wide open. Mark, you, you thought Jory was open in the flat also. Yeah. 
Ball fumbled and bobbled by Kenny Scott, the freshman. Decides to take it out, and it dropped at the five-yard line. In the second half. Barry, only a four-man rush. The little slip bubble screen inside to Chris Hale. Play action in the flat. Vakapuna takes it out to about the third. Four wide receivers for Barry. Underneath to Christensen. Toby Christensen stacked up by several Georgia Tech defenders after his. Barry now faces the second in the long nine. Underneath the coach on the crossing route. He gets it down inside. Barry, a much different looking quarterback as he is hammered. As he pitches to Brathwaite on the option. Brathwaite breaks a tackle. Three receivers bunched to the right side. Barry. Looking deep, has Christensen. Touchdown, Cougars! Punch set. Now it's very difficult. Good protection. Barry really got hit on that throw. The corner route to Christensen. When they bunch up like that and you're in zone coverage, you got to wait to see where they're going to go. That the good hit on Barry through that touchdown pass. He's a different quarterback. You mentioned it. Ball outside to Jimmy Dixon, the tight end, and BYU says they have the ball, and the officials agree. Gennaro Guilford, the corner, comes in and puts the hit on Dixon. That knocks the ball loose, and there is Francis, the eight yards on the night. Barry works out of the shotgun. Plenty of time. Back inside the Chris Hicks shotgun formation. Blitz by Georgia Tech. Outside, Kukahiku gets it down to about the 28 backfield. Quick throw, Christensen met immediately. Finds a way, works his way out close to the 10-yard line and hauled down at about the 8 for it. Lined up to the left side. Ball back to pass, one-on-one. -on -one. Miscommunication and intercepted. After the game at some point. Not sure if that has an effect on the exchange with the center or not, as he cranks one over the middle. Across the middle, Matt Berry, good protection right here in the shotgun. Gets to sit back there and wait for the route to come open. As Berry works from the shotgun on second and eight. Completed over the middle. Third down for Berry. Under pressure, manages to escape, and then flips it out. To Wilkerson. And that's going to be enough for a by the quarterback. It's out of the pocket, shuffles the ball, a little basketball pass to Chris Hale. I mean, left tackle, lucky he didn't get called for holding there. Had a jersey stretched out as Barry is now 29 of 43, 268, and the three touchdowns. Pitches it outside of Acapulco. Makes a couple people miss down the right sideline. Finally drug out of bounds at about the 21 yard line. Second and 15, Barry goes to Coates, brought down at the 21-yard line. Looks like he might be banked. Quarterback draw. Tahi motions out, empty backfield. The swing to Christensen is dropped outside by David. This the overload formation. BYU rushing three. Popinga with a sack on the quarterbacks. Nine catches for Smith tonight. His ball. Throws the ball out in the flat to number five, Nate Curry. And BYU says we've got the ball. It is your home for college football on the internet. So long, everybody.